Hi, welcome to Gates Charlie Middle School. I'm Dr. Lisa Buckshaw, the middle school principal. Throughout the district, we have been working on capital projects. Here at the middle school, we are very fortunate that ours is completed and you will be able to experience that when you join us in the fall. Our school may appear very big, but we divide it into three communities, sixth through eighth grade, so that it feels like it's a smaller, warmer, and safe place. I'd like to introduce you to our three assistant principals. Hi, I'm Mr. Cosa Tavalaris, assistant principal in the Rhinos community. Welcome. Hi, I'm Ms. Camila Rollins, assistant principal in the Amherst community. Welcome. Hi, and I'm Ms. Kim Doty, assistant principal in the Red Wing community. Welcome. Now two of our students will show you around the building. Hi, my name is Victoria and I'm a current 6th grader. And I'm Becky Temba, a current 8th grader. Today we'll be showing you around our school. And right now we're staying at the main entrance, door, known as door number 1. This is where the buses will drop you off and pick you up each day. This is the main office. There are two entrances. One from this main door for visitors and one from the school hallway for students. Dr. Buckshaw, our principal, is located in the main office. It is also where the teachers' mailboxes are located. Sometimes teachers send students to the main office to pick up their mail and drop off attendance folders. In addition to the principal, there are three assistant principals, one for each of the three smaller learning communities. The assistant principals and their secretaries have an office in their community hallway. The people in these offices are very helpful can, and can help you when needed. They can assist you with lockers, provide a phone to make a call home, or a chance to speak with a trusted adult about an issue you may be experiencing. The tech center is where our laptops and repairs are managed. If you need help with a computer or program issue, just complete an IT request online through Classic. Some students volunteer to be tech helpers during their study hall period. Look for information on how you can sign up to be a tech helper for next school year. This is our cafeteria. We have three lunch periods a day with lots of food options. We will review cafeteria expectations before your first lunch period and throughout the few, first few weeks of school. Just like in elementary school, we should use the sparring way and be, be respectful to each other, the staff in our shared space. This is our health office, located near the main entrance. Ms. Fowler and Ms. Jefferson are here to help you if you are not feeling well. The library is available for you to use during a study hall, lunch, or after school. You can check out books or work with Ms. Rajak to help you find books you are interested in. This is a counseling suite. Your school counselors are available to assist you with academic and social emotional needs. Request a pass to see a counselor by using your Gates Chala email. Need some school supplies? The Spartan Bookstore will be up and running in the beginning of the year. Look for information on times it is open and how to volunteer to work in the bookstore. These are the brand new family and consumer science and facts classrooms. These new spaces provide exciting learning opportunities such as cooking and sewing. Here is our newly renovated art room. The other art room is located near the health classrooms. Our art teachers are excited to have you explore your creativity in these spaces. Our health rooms are located off the back hallway. Sixth and seventh graders take health class. There you will learn and explore important topics related to your own personal growth and health. Just past the cafeteria and the gym, you will find the music hallway. Sixth grade and eighth grade students participate in general music. If you are in band or chorus, you will also find those practice areas in this location. A large gym, small gym, girls and boys locker rooms, and fitness room are all brand new. LPE staff works with students on expectations for locker room behavior and choices during PE class. We know all of this may seem overwhelming, but remember you will have time to visit the building in person and see these areas firsthand. 
Locker setup will be scheduled for the week before school starts, and we hope you will have the chance to tour a building in person then. Until then, please look for additional information to be shared over the summer.